Welcome back. This lecture is about multi-tenancy, which is a common term in cloud computing, particularly in software as a service environment. What is multi-tenancy? Multi-tenancy is a software architecture style where a single instance of software is shared by multiple end users or multiple distinct user groups. SaaS software is a typical example of multi-tenancy. Here are a few examples of SaaS software. Salesforce, Gmail, Microsoft Office 365, TurboTax, just to name a few. We also have the term single tenancy. It is the opposite of multi-tenancy. In single tenant, each end user or each group of users uses its own software instance. There are plenty of examples of multi-tenancy. Let's take the example of tax software. For example, TurboTax has its SaaS version. You can also find their old classic desktop version, which is a single user, or can be considered a single tenant. Let's take one more example, typing software. There are many SaaS software to practice typing that are deployed as multi-tenant. You can also find desktop versions that can be considered single tenant. The multi-tenancy concept is not new. In the mainframe era, which was around the 1960s, that time to share mainframe computing resources among multiple users, timeshare software was used. Cloud computing uses the same multi-tenancy idea to allow the sharing of computing resources in which the pool of computing resources, such as processing power and memory, is divided among multiple users or multi-tenants. This multi-tenancy is at the server level. SAS leverages multi-tenancy in which software instances are shared among multiple users. An important point to note is that like multi-tenancy in mainframe, in SAS also data for each user is separated or isolated, even though the same software instance is shared. Typically, SaaS providers separate databases for each SaaS client to separate data. With respect to multi-tenancy advantages, multi-tenancy saves costs. The reason is obvious. The computing resources are consolidated and shared among multiple users or clients. This sharing helps keep costs lower for individual users in a multi-tenant environment. For example, if you are using the TurboTax SaaS version instead of the TurboTax desktop or the single tenant version, using the SaaS version will be relatively less expensive than the TurboTax desktop version. Multi-tenancy enables flexibility. As we know, resource estimation is a challenging exercise. If you over-provision, the cost will go high. If you under-provision, then your output will suffer. On the other hand, in a multi-tenant environment, you only pay for what you use. Also, you would have to not worry about managing resources, such as applying patches, securing resources, etc., as the cloud provider takes care of resource management. 